What's happening, everybody? Jay Shockblast here, and check it out. Savage Opress is finally available as part of the Star Wars Clone Wars pack, um, which is available now. So, Mr. Opress here, uh, as many of you know, is the brother and apprentice of Darth Maul, and uh, he appeared in the Clone Wars. Um, he was... Oh, he's been an apprentice to, like, everybody, man. He's been... Uh, he was an apprentice with Dooku, he was working with Asajj Ventress, um, he's kind of been all over the place. Um, he came up with the Night Sisters of Dathomir and um, ultimately uh, gave up the ghost in a, uh, a duel with Darth Sidious. So, uh, he lived an interesting and intriguing life. Um, he was a very much a brute compared to... Uh, Maul. Uh, Maul was definitely uh, more properly trained, if you will. Um, so Maul is and always will be, um, you know, a true Sith. Um, Opress is more of like just a byproduct of the Sith way of life. You know, I don't really consider him a Sith per se, um, even though he. You know, did kind of have the dark side of the force going through and whatnot. I don't know, it felt very manufactured. Uh, like the Night Sisters kind of pumped it into him. Uh, kind of like they pumped it into uh, Maul, bringing him back. So, um, I think a lot of people were really looking forward to Opris here. Uh, he uses the double lightsabers that Maul uses. Um, and as you can see, in the Clone Wars, uh, Maul actually split to double lightsabers. Um, so, or, uh, yeah, the, the dual-wielding lightsaber style. Um, I look at Opris as just, like, I don't know. He, he's very brutish, very, you know, one-track mind, not nearly as uh, cunning as Maul. Um, so, yeah, man. Uh, definitely an interesting scene to watch him go, him and his brother go up against Sidious. Uh, when they did, and, um, he did lose an arm to Obi-Wan Kenobi, and he does have at least one Jedi kill under his belt. Uh, he killed Adi Gallia, I believe. <clears throat> um, so there is that. Um, yeah, man, uh, Savage Opress. I love the way he just stands, like, he's just very authoritarian, if you will, you know? Um, just, there's something, you know, like intimidating about him. He knows that he's intimidating. He knows that he's a monster. And, uh, you know, it comes across very well in his design in this game. So, uh, definitely a, a really cool character to add uh, to your character list. I know Darth Maul has been a very popular character in this game. And, uh, you know, I think the fact that Savage Opus is here uh, is only going to amplify that a bit. Uh, he's not going to appear on my top 10. Um, I didn't really have any like personal connection to Savage Opress. I'm much more of a Darth Maul kind of guy. But, uh, you know, uh, just two... This is definitely one of the biggest deadly duos of brothers in the Star Wars universe. That is for sure. Um, so, uh, there you go. Darth Maul and Savage Opress. Um... Got to see a little bit of Oprah's kind of fighting some people, doing the thing, and uh, yeah, man. So, what do you guys think of Savage Oprah's? Uh, what do you think of his kind of place in the Star Wars mythos? And, uh, you know, I was never a huge fan of Darth Maul coming back, but I think they kind of handled it right. Um, never made sense that he was cut in half <laughs> and survived, but... You know, weirder things have happened, and that's the reason why a lot of people think Mace Windu may still be alive. Anyway, uh, Savage Opera is available now. We'll see it.